We are back with another episode. This time we are going to talk about Oscar nominations. So here it is. Oscar nominations of 2023. Everything Everywhere leads with Love and Nuts, followed by Banshees and All Quiet. Number 1. Shockingly, the Oscars red carpet isn't even a traditional red, it's actually more of a burgundy. The LA Times reveals the carpet is closer to burgundy and has been for the last 15 years. The exclusive shade called Academy Red is supposed to flatter the A-list actors who are photographed and filmed walking on it. It's a secret color, one whose precise specifications the show's organizers won't reveal for fear of copycats. This specific color is also patented and doesn't appear on any other red carpet in the whole universe. Number 2 Each nominee is given a complimentary pair of tickets, but additional tickets cost between $150 to $1000. The main factor in determining the prices is actually dependent on where the seats are located in the Dolby Theater. Number 3 The Vanity Fair Oscar party is the most popular after party for those who attend the ceremony and for those who don't too. Tickets reportedly range from $25,000 to $105,000. Wow. Number 4 all 25 nominees from the top individual categories receive a six-figure gift bag with several luxury items. This year's include skincare products from Miege, luggage and flip-flops from Vianas, hair restoration services from Bowman Medical, a silk pillowcase from Blush Silks, and a travel pillow from PETA. Number 5 the Oscar statuettes are made of solid bronze and plated in 25 karat gold. They are also 13.5 inches tall and weigh 8.5 pounds. According to the Academy Awards, the statuette is a stylized figure of a knight holding a crusader's sword standing on a reel of film with five spokes signifying the five original branches of the Academy – actors, directors, producers, technicians and writers. Number 6. Immediately after winners receive their Oscar, they must sign an agreement that states if they ever wish to sell their statuette, they must offer it to the Academy first for $1. Number 7. Michael Jackson actually holds the record for buying the most expensive Oscar statuette where he paid $1.5 million for David O. Selznick's Best Picture Award for Gone with the Wind. Unfortunately, the Oscar statuette has been missing since Jackson's death in 2009. This award was won back in 1940, before the Academy's selling agreement came into play. Number 8 it takes 18 people and almost 900 hours of work to lay down the red carpet for the event. Lynn Nicholas, the West Coast Regional Sales Manager for Signature Systems, told the LA Times there are road closures, there is heavy security, there is definitely a buzz in the air, we just block everything out, just do our job. Number 9. There are 735 bleacher seats available for fans to watch celebrities walk the red carpet. Fans are chosen through lottery, promotions, contests, and are sometimes friends and family members of attendees. Number 10 Back in 2000, Angelina Jolie got locked out of the ceremony the same year she won Best Supporting Actress. She told Entertainment Tonight, they said, we're sorry, the doors are locked. I went around the back and tried to get in, then they had a commercial break, so I managed to run in, got to my seat, and literally had just sat down. Number 11. 
Number 11. The Academy Awards nominees and winners are selected by the members of the Motion Picture Academy of Arts and Sciences, which has more than 6,000 members. The entire membership votes for the Best Picture nominees, but the other categories are voted for by specific branches. For example, the Actors Branch votes for Best Actor and Best Actress nominees. Then, for the final vote, the membership go online to select the winners in every category, not just their branch. Number 12 When voting for the Academy Award nominees, people don't just vote for their favorite, they actually submit a list of their top 5 favorites ranked. Then, the candidates who receive enough first place rankings become nominees in the category. Number 13 While there's no cash prize for winning an Oscar, each Best Actor and Best Actress winner gets an estimated 20% boost on their pay for the next film. Number 14. Until the envelopes are opened on stage, only two people from Pricewater House Coopers, the company that tallies the votes, actually know who the winners are. They also memorize all the winners just in case something goes awry with the envelopes. Remember the, that La La Land Moonlight Best Picture snafu? Said the wrong thing. This is. This is not a joke. Moonlight has won Best Picture. Moonlight, Best Picture. I think you guys should keep it anyway. Oh, it's Warren. I'm sorry. Guys. And number 15. Walt Disney holds the record for most Oscars ever won, who received 26 Academy Awards during his lifetime. 